never mind. Looking very cute. Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. We are getting close to Christmas now. I'm sorry I haven't been here for the past few days. I would say I've been busy, but I haven't. Quickly before we get into this video, you may notice behind me, the new merch has finally arrived to us. So it got lost in the post somewhere because a lot of you guys got it before us and we ordered them weeks before you guys, but never mind. So I'll quickly show you, we've got the Pablo, Winston and Stanley t-shirts just in the black. We've also got a Stanley t-shirt in the white and there's a, there's a reason. We've got the Lapug Pablo and Co, like the new logo on, I've got two of them. We've got the blocked Winston t-shirt. And then we've got the Lapug Pablo and Co jumper. We've got the Pablo jumper. And then we've got the Lapo Pablo and Co jumper as well. So there's two Pablos, two Winstons, and two Stanleys. So there's an equal amount of each. So nobody get in the comments and say, I'm wearing a Pablo one. It just depends what day I'm filming, depends what day I'll have on. So I love it all though, because it just looks like normal clothes. It doesn't look like it's merch or anything like that. It just looks like a normal t-shirt you can buy from a shop, which is what I like. And if you do want to get any of it, it should be below the video. I'll leave a link in stuff like that, teespring.com forward slash double Pablo, whatever it is. Anyways, today's video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be trying some new food for the boys because we're in the shop getting them the normal food. And then we've seen they had some new food. So we thought, well, what we'll do is we'll get some small bags of it do some taste tests and see if they like any of it and then we can maybe get some in the future. Now you're probably thinking, but pugs will eat anything. Why do you even need to taste test them? Why does not get a big bag? Because last time we done this, they did not like one of them. Idiot, the other ones. I can't remember which one it was now, but they didn't like one of them. So what we do, so what we do is we buy a big bag of the food fill this up, once this is empty, we then get one of the other bags that I like and then fill that up with this and then we kind of rotate the food to keep it like interesting because kibble isn't the most interesting of food so we thought we'll just mix up the flavour every now and then so it's not all the same and the dog get bored of it. But now, Ooh, new flavours. So hopefully if they're like these we can have like a rotation so we can go from like our old two foods to then that to then that to then that and then go again. So over the course of the year, you'll get different foods. So you say, just to mix it up, keep it interesting, and you're so cute. You're so cute. So hopefully they like these. Now, unfortunately, they didn't actually have the little, little bags in these two. So hopefully they like them because, well, it's a waste of money otherwise. So we've got countryside casserole with chicken, duck, and sweet potatoes. We've got salmon supper with sweet potatoes, peas, and dill. And then we've got Wild Woodland Walk with duck, salmon, and venison. Now off the top of my head, I can't remember what the other two foods are, but I'll put a picture of them here so you can so you can see what they are. I'm pretty sure they'll like this one. I think they might like this one. Don't know about this. We haven't really gave them fish. I just see meat, meat, fish. Never really had fish before. But also, if it makes your poop stink, it makes your breath stink, We'll just use the other ones. Let's go. So this is what we've gone for. So you can see what's in each bowl. So Pablo, go on then, go on then. Okay, straight in for the countryside casserole. Wanna try the woodland walk? Okay, mister, what do you think of them? Do you like them? Would you have some of them? Would you? Would you like them? Good boy. Same setup again, but this time, with Stanley. Go on then, mister. Go on. Go on. Okay, straight for the fish. Okay, good boy. Last run. Winston. Go on then, mister. Go on. Straight for his own ball. Okay, that's two that I've gone straight for the fish. I'll hold him, I'll hold him. No, I'm not taking it off them, I'm just holding it. 
Ow! You hungry beans. Whoa. Whoa. You like them? Did you like them? I like your donut, thank you. So I don't like all of them, so just don't get whatever the green one was, I guess. But no, they absolutely seem to just, well, yeah, you see, they love them. No hesitation on any of them, straight in. I'm not going to be getting this one though, and it it's probably just because to do fish. I don't eat fish. I don't particularly like the smell of it. The smell of this, actually, it smells like a zoo. And I know that sounds really weird, but it smells like a zoo. It doesn't smell like fish. It smells like a zoo. I can't explain it, but I'm not keen. And we know you're a trumpers, so I'm not risking that one. But these two, these two are a win. We'll get some of these, so we'll fly through these. But people always ask what food you feed them. Lily's Kitchen, grain free, you know, proper meat, no fillers. All natural ingredients, loads of benefits. And the packets are full of helpful tips so you know how much you're feeding them, how to transfer them onto it and stuff. And yeah, that's why we feed them Lily's Kitchen, because it's. And you just love it, don't you? He's a nice, healthy boy, except Pablo. Pablo's fat, because we've been feeding him too much of it. That's daddy's fault. Sorry, little man. We had him to the vets just recently. Pablo's overweight. Winston's fine, and his joints are fine. Stanley's fine, although Stanley's eye is starting to glaze over a little bit again. But it looks fine. There's no nothing, no marks we can see on it or anything yet. So I think he's just got a sore eye currently, and that's just how it is. Did any of you notice? I just noticed. So when we went to the pet shop, they were listed as new products. So we just seen them and bought them. They're not new products at all. They've changed a day in the country, which is in a yellow packet, to now in an orange packet called Countryside Casserole. And the Wild Woodland Walk, which is in the brown packet, is now a Wild Woodland Walk, but in a pink packet. But it's duck, salmon and venison, as opposed to venison and duck with salmon. The fish one is new, so what we've established from this video is, the packets have changed for our food, and we're going to keep buying them. So... Thank you guys for watching, hope you liked, and if you did, drop a like on the video. Peace out guys.